It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Lord Chambry Brewery and it's a bottle of their Wild Fennel Brown Ale coming in at 5.9% ABV in a 330 milliliter bottle. This beer is from Malta. The brewery is from Malta. I'm quite excited to get this one open into a glass and see what we get. Many thank you to Neil Long. Thank you, Neil, for sending me the beer. Cheers. A little bit of smoke on the bottle opening. Beer in the glass. Brown ale. Oof. Brown ale, brown ale. Let's have a look at this one. It started to pour like an amber. But yeah, I'm. Ooh, that is. It's close to amber. I'm going to say brown. I'm going to say a brown ale, but it's very, very close to being an amber ale. It must be just down to the to the, the availability of roasted malt in Malta. It can be very difficult to get hold of there. Um, I can't imagine many breweries in Malta using roasted malt bar Lord Chambry. So um, that's probably the reason why it's looking like, like this. Uh, we got a one finger white head, slow moving carbonation, hazy looking dark amber brown ale. Uh, let's get the aroma. Well, there is there's most definitely some chocolate malt in there. You definitely get that. It's almost like white chocolate. Quite citrusy, fennel's coming through nicely. Floral kind of fennel aroma. Let's dive in. Cheers everybody. Cheers Neil. Really interesting, really interesting. Uh, I think clever brewing, clever brewing is more, more the answer here. I think the, 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 the brewer may have used a little bit of cacao nib or something, something quite bitter, quite chocolatey in the brew to get over the fact that it, I, I'm not sure that there's that there's roasted malt in this beer I think it, it I met a Portuguese brewer um, some years ago in Poland of all places at the Wrocław beer festival and he, he, he told me that it's so difficult to get certain malts certain hops in Portugal Portugal because he was one of the only craft brewers there and and to be able to to buy specialty malts to buy specialty hops was so difficult for him and I I fear this is the same thing for this lovely little Maltese brewery called Lord Chambry is that the fact that the they probably really want to brew a, a, a brown ale or a dark ale you know brown Yeah, brown ale more than stout. It's it's really close. It's really close. They they've tried their very best with what they've been able to get hold of. I reckon there's some cacao nib in there. I, I've not looked at the bottle. I might be completely wrong. Um, you get the fennel. You get the light, nice biscuity, bready, malty flavours. Um, there's a little bit of bitterness on the back end. There, is, there are some really nice, to be fair to the beer, there are, there are some nice kind of dark, kind of nutty, biscuity, bready flavours coming through. So yeah, you could you could call it kind of maybe like a close to a nut brown ale. I've, I've changed my mind on this one now because because I have. I 
amber kind of brown ale thing going on. It's nice. It, 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 it's nice. It's nice for, again, I'll mention it one more time, the availability of malt and hops and, 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 and they've, they've worked really hard to get to, to get a brown ale here. Uh, the ingredients are water, malted barley, hops, fennel seeds and yeast. Um, so I've had some of the other beer, the Coral Reef beer from Coral Bay, Coral Cave beer from Lord Chambry just the other day. And they're using local ingredients. They're getting around the fact that they may struggle to get certain ingredients by using local ingredients. So they've, they've used fennel in this beer. So, uh, so our, special, our seasonal brews are limited releases throughout the year that champion local ingredients and catch the spirit of the island, of the seasons of the Maltese islands. Um, while fennel brown ale is a unique take on the style, brewed with a subtle addition of peat, malt and wild fennel seeds, harvested in gozo there you go yeah it's it's a good beer it's a good beer they use some peated smoked malt in the beer there we go rating i like it i like it it's different it's interesting um i reckon i like that enough to give it it's it's a it's an eight out of ten definitely. I like the I like the use of the fennel. Eight out of ten. Thank you to Neil for sending. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.